In this video, we'll walk you through StyleZone's new Color Up workspace. Start by uploading your style in the default VQS in vStitcher. This automatically creates and uploads a GLB file to StyleZone. Let's hide the avatar and click on the Color Up icon to enter the workspace. This will automatically create a new colorway. To create more colorways, you can use the plus icon at the bottom of the screen. You can review the garment either by its materials or pattern pieces. You can choose whether you want to edit the material of the entire garment or specific parts by clicking on the parts you want to edit by piece or in the 3D window. When clicking on specific pattern pieces, this automatically opens up the list of all the materials used for the piece. You can change the color, transparency, size, and more. These options are available for all materials, from fabric and seams to artwork and trims. Great! Now let's save the new colorway. To dive deeper into the Color Up Workspace's capabilities, let's move on to a different garment. By clicking on All Materials, we can easily replace elements such as fabric, stitches, artwork, and seams. As before, you can edit their color, transparency, and size. You'll also find a Select All checkbox that allows you to recolor the entire garment at once. Let's add a custom color palette and use it to recolor the whole t-shirt. Now, let's select the artwork from the Materials menu and change its color separately. Great! Now let's save the new colorway. In addition, the onboarding button allows everyone involved in the collection creation process to access the new variations in the Color Up workspace. By clicking on the onboarding button, a new folder is created in the Personal Zone board complete with three garments to help you begin your exploration of the Color Up workspace. The new colorways are automatically added to the style and collection. Now, you can easily share it for peer review. To learn more about the Color Up workspace, visit help.browseware.com.